All right, we're taking a look at the Redline 5615 SE by Nebo Tools. And this flashlight is a, an exceptional value for the money. Uh, runs about 40 bucks on NeboTools.com, but there's a variety of other retailers that are selling it as low as uh, right around 30. And I'm gonna just go ahead and describe the specifications on this light and then we're going to go over some of the cool features that it has to offer. So first off, the runtime at 100% light, which is its max mode, it produces 250 lumens of light and it runs for 4 hours while accomplishing that task. And the viewing distance is 175 yards, so I'll go ahead and show you. That's a pretty bright light. Shine the camera, white it out, <laughs> probably blind you guys. Um, then it has a 50% mode, which you just hold down, reduce the light, 50% runs for 8 hours, has a viewing distance of 76 yards, and produces 125 lumens of light. And then it has the 10% uh, light, and that produces 25 lumens, with a runtime of 15 hours and a viewing distance of 34 yards. And you can see that's still pretty bright, still accomplishes the task and you're getting 15 hours runtime. Uh, then an SOS mode, which is just basically a sporadic type um, flashing beacon letting you know that you're in trouble. And also a disorienting type strobe to, uh, to kind of protect you against uh, an attacker and we'll get into that in a minute and it's not that the light exactly is going to protect you but the cool feature that this has to offer so let's go into the features we have starting from back to front this thing has a magnet inside of here which allows you to attach it to a steel surface um, say a refrigerator or a car or whatever you're working on so you can provide light in front of you and you don't have to worry about somebody holding the flashlight so that comes in handy this also little rubber uh, button here is glow in the dark so it makes it a little bit easier for you to see it in a nighttime situation um, it's kind of beveled the body, the construction of this is anodized aircraft aluminum and uh, it's also weatherproof, uh, water resistant and let's go ahead and open this thing up. Also the belt clip as you can see there so you can attach it onto your belt or whatever. Uh, when you pull this off you have a little rubber o-ring there so keeping the, uh, the water out and you can see this is a pretty high quality little, little piece and that's what uh, the front's going to look like and this is basically just a little battery carrier here and it takes three AAA batteries put them in there so it's a little bit cooler than most you know you're going to find with like a Phoenix or something uh, Phoenix flashlights most likely are going to have like a CR123 or um, some of those other uh, different type batteries not your mainstream AAA, AA's so the AAA's make it nice I like that uh, they're a little more common. The exterior, this body, is tough. Like I said, it's aircraft aluminum. Uh, has these little beveled pieces here, which are pretty much like a uh, they're a heat sink bezel, so it allows the heat to dissipate during extended use. Uh, basically, keeping this cooler, allowing it to last longer. Uh, and then when you turn it on, it has this little red thing that kind of like glows reddish orange. Um, I don't know, not a whole lot of function to that. Kind of looks cool, looks kind of uh, professional. Doesn't quite show up on the camera uh, the same color it does in person. Now, the front this is probably one of the coolest features of this flashlight, and it's the fact that it has this aggressive face design to it. And this basically allows you to use this as a defense weapon, um, which is great for women, children, really anybody who's going out there walking at night. 
and they're concerned about their safety. Maybe you don't want to be carrying a gun or maybe you live in an area where carrying a gun's not a not a, not an easy thing to do without being harassed and you don't have a concealed carry so you don't want to go to jail because you know how crazy the laws are. Um, so this, you know, you're looking for something that's like a non-lethal weapon uh, that is going to help protect you. Well, just by gripping this guy, okay, in your hand, and I have um, probably larger hands than most, but gripping this really in this way, let's zoom out a little bit here, you can use this to kind of beat somebody up. Uh, you take this end and jab it into their eye while you have your uh, disoriented strobe going on. Let's pull that up. So you have this going on. They're coming at you and you're beating them up with it. Now, it, it's not that difficult. Some, some of you might think that that sounds a little wild little far-fetched but it is not um, you could definitely use this thing and basically just holding it like this and pushing it into somebody's face like hard like you're punching them so I mean you obviously want to know a little bit about fighting and stuff like that but let's not get into that uh, the fact of the matter is this could definitely be used to to beat somebody up as well as illuminate and I love to see multiple features all in one here uh, let's end with describing a few more things just in case you guys want to know uh, the actual specifications on this as well for the length is four and a half inches the diameter is one and a half inches and the weight is 0.428 pounds and then it does come with AAA batteries three of them so that gives you um, that gives you what you need ready to go so if you guys are looking for something that uh, is gonna give you really an excellent value for 30 to 40 bucks something you could carry with you in your car something you can have with you at work um, maybe you have um, a bug out bag some type of emergency pack so this is a great little flashlight for that too and you're not gonna worry about it getting squished broken beat up you could probably beat this thing up all day throw it around and it could take the punishment so if you have any questions comments concerns please leave them in the comment box and as always have a great day and we'll be putting out some more videos soon